Hello, this is Rob Boberty here with The Long Rain. This game is based on a short story by Ray Bradbury. And in this story, it takes place on the planet Venus, and they don't know much about Venus then, so in the story, Venus is a very, very rainy place. It constantly rains. And let's see what we got here. This is a point-and-click kind of adventure. Mr. Jenkins. I guess I need... I, uh, hello. Hello, Mr. Cloud Guy. Hello. He doesn't say very much. This cloud sure has a creepy looking face. Okay, right click to examine, left click to interact. Okay. Uh, let's see. So anyway, the, uh, the story is about four soldiers, or I think they're soldiers. It kind of seems like they're soldiers. And they're kind of going nuts because they get stuck in the rain and trying to make it to some sanctuary kind of area, place where enclosed and there's like an artificial sun. It's kind of interesting. They kind of go nuts. Only one of them makes it through. Okay, here's a crybaby. Hello. Oh, hello. I wasn't crying. <laughs> Why were you crying? I wasn't crying. I'm just a little sad because my son has gone out. What do you mean, your son? Here on Ray's Venus, the natural sun is blocked by that twatty cloud. So each house has an artificial sun supplying heat and solar energy. The new models run on electricity, but mine is a cheap old gas guzzler. And it's gone out. Sad face. I'm lost. Where the heck am I? I'm lost. Where the heck am I? We are on Ray Bradbury's inaccurately imagined Venus. Duh. Ray who buries inaccurately imagined what? Who what buries what leave what and where? <laughs> who what buries what leave what and where? Ray Bradbury's inaccurately imagined Venus. It's an imaginary realm that exists mainly in Ray Bradbury's head. And partly in a book or something. How do I get home? How do I get home? Wherever you want to go, you need to start by finding your way to the hub. You can get there by the, via the path to better things, but you'll need a map. Where can I get a map? Where can I get a map? I have one in my house, but I'm scared to go in there while it's all dark. Never fear, I shall fix thy sun and retrieve thy map. Neato. Here, you'll need this. It's a key. Okay, let's see. A tear towel? Of course. Do you need your tear towel back? Nope. Sop up the, the cloud? Nope. What's this? It's a sign. I think I'll leave that there. Okay. Put the towel on it. Nope. Nope. Okay. Path into forest. I'm not going into that forest without some sort of map. Okay, so I need a map. Under busted up dome. Okay, I played another game by this developer that used the same uh, pictures and everything. And so it's kind of similar in, in appearance, but it's a very different kind of game. Hello, bookkeeper. Hello, hello. What happened to your house, bro bro? <laughs> bro bro? Got left up, didn't it? Any more questions? Why you got no legs, dog? F you, you got. Why you got so many? <laughs> Can I borrow one of your books, hombre? I guess if you promise to be careful with it. What sort of book are you looking for? Let's see. Do you have any books about adventure game tactics? Do you have any books containing a map of the local area? Uh, I don't know. Do you have any books about adventure game tactics? Let me see. The other guy's going to give me a map, supposedly. So I guess I'm not getting a map from him. Walkthrough. Okay. Hello, hello. I'm going to go somewhere else. Smile you later, Twit. Okay. Would you like a cloth? Wouldn't my bear like a cloth? Any of this stuff go together? I think things go. To, I think things combine in this. Can I look at these? Oh, it's a walkthrough for something called Monkey Island. Oh, okay. I figured it was joking that it was a walkthrough for this. I guess that won't help me. This tear towel is super absorbent. It's the key to the sad dude's house. Sad dude's house. Oh, yeah. I can go to his house. Oh, tree, tree. Snap! I broke a tree. That's a real nice stick. Okay. Can I beat things with a stick? I don't think that would help. I want to. Be, can I beat the book? Nope. I don't think you'd like that. What's that? The light. I'm not touching that dingus. I'll get zapped. Okay. How uh, do I touch it with a stick? Nope. That didn't help. He did it though. He tried, so that might mean something. Usually, you just say no. Can I beat this with a stick? Nope. Can I beat the cloud with a stick? Okay. Can I beat you with a stick? No, he doesn't want that. Okay. It's locked. Okay. Oh, uh. Okay, let's open that door. 
Enter scary dark dome. Okay, that's dark. Uh, let's see what we have here. Ew, it feels all gross and icky. Oh, left click. Gross and icky stuff? It smells like coffee? <laughs> it's cold. It feels like the belly of a marshmallow monster. I don't want to make it angry. Okay, once I click it, once I le right click it to examine, it, it gets a name. Robotic. It feels like a robotic wolf skeleton. What's this? It's giving off an eternal void of nothingness vibes. Okay, any other question marks? Let's see what other question marks we got here. Got that one. Let's see. It smells like old people. What smells like? Oh, there's something there. What's that? Feels like a big evil trombone or something. <laughs> evil trombone, of course. What is that? I don't want to touch it. Oh, what's this? It smells like paraffin. Oh, okay. Uh, oh. No. Nope. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, wait. I got it. I got it. Make a torch. Make a torch. Now the towel's all paraffin y. This has to be good. Okay. Can I do anything here with the stick? Coffee? Nope. Okay. Eternal void. Of, throw the stick into the eternal void of nothingness. No, I think we're done here. Let's see what else we can find. Okay. So we've got a stick and a book. Will you read my book? Nope. He won't read my book. Can I read you the book? Nope. Won't read my book. Okay. Let's see. Uh. Let's try that. Try the stick. Now that it... Aha! Uh -huh. Fire! Oh, if... Uh, I'm on fire. Oh. Okay, can I light something on fire with this? No, don't want to burn that. Don't... don't I don't want to burn that. Okay. Let's go out here, then. Okay. Ah! Why'd you stop? Bummer, the rain put out my fire stick. Okay. So, I need my fire stick. I imagine I need my fire stick in that guy's house where it's dark. So, how do I get past the rain? Hmm. Okay, set my book on fire. Set my book on fire again. Or, set my uh, torch on fire again. Maybe burn the book. Can I burn Mr. Jenkins? Can I burn his book pile? Nope. I don't want to burn that. I don't want to burn anything. I can go outside, but as soon as I walk, it looks like it goes out. So, let's see. Uh, I can't... Oops. I can't walk anywhere out here. Oops. Pretty sure this jump has no legs. It's a cool pile of soggy books. So rad. Maybe I want to burn it. Okay. It's a tree stump. Okay. Sparky! There's nothing else I can see to click on here. There's some way I'm supposed to... No, it goes out as soon as I get there. Hmm. I'm not going into the forest without some sort of map. So I need a map. Let's see, what can I do? Do I need to block the fire? Nothing seems to combine with the stuff I have. I can't do anything with that. Let me go back in here see if I missed something. Okay, what do we got? We got old people. What does that mean? Why does it smell like old people? It smells like old people. Okay, paraffin. Get extra paraffin on it? Nope. Wait, nothingness. Robotic wolf skeleton. I don't want to do that. Put everything in the robotic wolf skeleton. Nope. What else is there? Marshmallow monster. What would the marshmallow monster be? Coffee? I think I tried this already. Must be something evil trombone. What does that mean? I think I gotta put... Do something here. Gross and icky stuff. Put that in there? Nope. Put this in the eternal void of nothingness? Nope. Hmm. Already tried that one. Eternal void of nothingness has nothing in it. Old people. What does the old people? What could the old people be? 
That's paraffin. It's probably a candle or something. But what is the old people? Marshmallow monster. Could be a couch. Is that the bear on the couch? I don't know. Robotic wolf skeleton. That could be a sculpture, maybe, or an art. No. Robotic wolf skeleton. Maybe he has a dog. I don't know. Maybe it's, maybe it's a robotic wolf. Maybe everything is actually accurate here. Could be. Don't want to pick that up. Don't want to make it angry. I think I'm going to keep away from that. Don't want to get my hands all flammable. Don't want to touch it. Trombone. That might be cursed. Okay, I can't touch anything. Old people, it goes all the way here. That could be... Man, I have no idea what anything is. All right, all right. I don't think there's anything here. Let's exit out and see what we can find. What else we can find? It's a mushroom. Can I do anything with the mushroom? Take my stick. Nope. Take my book. Nope. Take a key back. Take a teddy bear. Take something. Nope. Okay. I already tried giving everything to the cloud and using everything on that. Hmm. Let's see. I already tried setting the books on fire. Didn't like that idea. Must be something. Okay, I can't burn any of this stuff. Can't burn myself. Won't let me burn his books. As much sense as that makes. Okay, uh, there's got to be something out here because it lets me go out here. Is there something flammable here? Set the forest on fire? No, I can't even get to the forest trail. Hmm. Oh, rain put out my. Oh. There must be something. Something to do with the teddy bear. I haven't done anything with the teddy bear or the book. Oh, you know what? He's got the other book. Let me try the other book. See if that helps. Maybe I need the other book. Hello, hello. Can I borrow one of your books, hombre? Uh, let's see. Rain dances. Rain dances. That's new, I think. It's probably going to be something different. Clouds goes. Okay, I only have one book, though. Looks like. Okay, I can't do that. Maybe I show it to the cloud. Maybe he takes a nap. Let's see. Once upon a time, there was a young cloud named Alfred, Alfred Cloudbottom. Oop. The rain went to sleep. Yay! I can use fire. And they all lived happily ever after. And the cloud's sleeping. Yay. Okay. Alright, now I can set my stick on fire. <laughs> he freaks out. <laughs> Starts running around. I gotta get out of here. I don't know if he'll wake up. Can I can I burn him? Nope. Enter scary dark drum. Now I should be able to see. Oh. A little bit. What? I can't see anything. Oh, I know. I hope this isn't as stupid as it seems. Ah! Lit it up. Okay. Huh. I won! Game over, you won! I didn't get a map, though, and I didn't walk through. Should have probably ended with him walking through. Through the path, anyway. So the old people was the books. I guess that kind of makes sense. The trombone was the record player. Evil trombone. The uh, robotic skeleton was... was a chair and some towels. And something stinky, probably the food. It's probably old. Well, that was The Long Rain. It was a pretty interesting game. It was not too long, but it was pretty interesting and kind of fun. Got stuck a little bit, a little confused. Uh, but this has been Rob Bobberty, and I hope you enjoyed watching. If you have any comments, go and put them below or send me a message. If you have any ideas for a different game for me to play or anything, go ahead send me send me a message some way that, that way too. And as always, likes and subscribes are appreciated and I hope you enjoyed watching. Have a good day. Do, 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 do. This, oh, wait a minute. Before I leave. Oh no, I can't do anything. It's just showing me. Okay, bye!